A good teacher is someone who can share their enthusiasm and their passion, who is able to kind of learn something new alongside their students. A good teacher is someone who builds the ethos of care into the classroom, someone who thinks deeply about their students, and Julie is someone who is very, very sincere and has like a deep level of respect for the students. My name is Julie Boyer. I teach in the Gender, Sexuality, and Women's Studies program. Uh, I teach queer theory, uh, trans studies, a course on the history of sexuality called Sex and Sexualities. A lot of the work that we do in the Gender, Sexuality, and Women's Studies program really is about introducing students to counter histories. If we're leaving out the perspectives of queer people, if we're leaving out the perspectives of queer people of color, if we're leaving out the perspectives of women, um, in many cases, you know, a canonical history is doing that, um, then they're missing um, the broader picture. Right, the broader social landscape that we all are trying to share. So you can really tell that she spends a lot of time thinking about how students are going to feel handling uh, perhaps difficult or challenging subject matter. And I think in a field uh, like gender studies, where a lot of people have really personal investments in kind of what they're studying, that sort of care and consideration is really important. University of Pittsburgh students, in my experience, are super open-minded. They're really excited to engage with these topics. In many cases, they've never had a chance to speak in an academic environment about something that we tend to view as a very private issue. But we know that in many cases, it's also an extremely public issue. And um, it tends to be um, you know, hard to even get your lectures out because the students are just eager to really jump in and talk about the, the research. There's sort of a trope or a narrative that, that it can be like pulling teeth to get students to speak up in class. Um, but I seem to remember in a lot of her classes, uh, there being a really healthy and productive exchange, exchange of views. Um, and I think kind of a rare opportunity where people that maybe had different opinions are actually learning from each other. In conversations, in classrooms, in discussions, and also in their office hours, just running into them in the elevator, the stairwell, you could always have like a very meaningful conversation with them, even if it's a five second conversation. I don't ever leave a class and leave what I've learned from Julie in the class. It always transcends and comes with me.